morning from uh, 28 Michigan, headed west, not east, the west. Turn off the radio and talk to you for a minute, right? Uh, what was I going to talk to you about? Nothing, nothing's happened so far. I woke up, I went into Walmart. I always wonder what people think about me when I walk into Walmart early in the morning, having just rolled out of the back of my van. Sitting there picking up items and putting them back because I can't make any decisions on what I need to buy. But I did come away with some food and groceries. A little bit of cereal and milk. And uh, I am ready to hit the woods for another night. And then I gotta go to Walmart tomorrow again and exchange this camera for a Canon camera so that it plays nicer with the MacBook. Right now I'm on the 28th listening to country music because that's what they like to play here in Michigan. Did you know that adding your child's name to your bank account or the deed for your home could make that asset vulnerable to the child's divorce? Michigan's driver responsibility fees may soon face a slow repeal at the state capitol. The state Senate panel is discussing a measure that would prohibit the fees from being assessed for driving without a license or proof of insurance. Ten minutes later, and there's blue skies above. It's still kind of raining, but the sun's out. I guess this is what summertime in Michigan's like, huh, Nora? See Nora's rock she found? Very pretty. Very nice rock. This is camp along the Sturgeon River. In Michigan. I'm ready for my new camera. I don't like getting this one out because I'm worried I'm going to scratch it and make it unreturnable. Oh well. It's actually it's a great camera. Just uh, it doesn't play very nice with my MacBook. Find something else to talk about, Jordan. Yeah, I got nothing. I'm just going to sit here real quietly beside the river because that's what I like to do. It's monologue time. I haven't really filmed anything today, so I'll talk to you for a little while and fill up the rest of this 10 minute video. I know her. You can always put Nora on camera, she works. Works so well. I'm tired. I've been tired for the past couple of days. I think after, I'm going to be really tired by the end of summer, having been on the road for a year. I just keep finding myself more and more drained. I don't know, it's weird, I sleep good at night. I don't get as much exercise as I should some days. I eat well, I sleep well. I think just the constant moving and new location and new surroundings is just... 
I used to love it because it was so mentally stimulating and invigorating and new. New every day. But now, I still like it. I still enjoy it. But I think I'm starting to realize how it can be draining. There's some type of peace and rest that the body finds in being in the same place every day. Or seeing the same surroundings every day. It's some type of... Uh, Maybe a guard that the body lets down, or anyways, it's. I'm guessing that's why I'm so tired. I don't think it's mono. I haven't been kissing anybody. But either way, I'm tired. Today was a good day. I drove about 60 miles, meh, probably 30 miles. Somewhere around 30 miles. Found a good spot right off the highway to park and stay the night. I'm hoping it's going to be a good spot. I still got to stay the night. Cooked dinner. Hung out by the river. Didn't do much of anything all day. But hung out by the river. Played my harmonica a little bit. Threw the stick for Nora a little bit. And read a little bit. I need to get another good book. I've finished my Hemingway. The I have what some Russian like opera story that I'm reading. It's interesting. Poetic. Good description of the rivers and woods and lakes. I wonder how much footage I got today. Not very much. This is sad. This is really sad. Just staring at myself in a camera. Don't know why I do these videos every day. Something to do with. You get to upload a video, it's got to be 10 minutes on YouTube. And then there was a bunch of people out there doing the daily vlogs, like... Shea Carl and... His Shaytard family. And other people out there that I had seen doing the vlogs, so I thought that was a good idea for my travels. And then 10 minutes, that's the YouTube allowed amount of video time, so... That's why you get 10 minutes of me every day. I try to show you my traveling and what happens while I'm traveling. Lately, it's just been a bunch of me talking to the camera. And a lot less action. I did catch a fish the other day. I keep telling myself... I'm playing with the camera. This camera's got a little face finder on it. See if it can find my face. I keep telling myself tomorrow I'm going to get my new Canon camera. And then I won't be so worried about this camera because I'll have returned it. and I'll get the Canon out more and film more. But who knows what will really happen. I'm excited to be getting back into some pine tree com companies country and out of the hardwood forest of the east I like the pine tree forest better I decided the lights better there's too much green in the hardwood forest there's so much green different greens and just clashing greens almost whereas the pines is just deep dark greens or the light burnt brown and yellows and the lights better in a pine tree you know, I think it lets more light through, but it also kind of creates a more darker, shadier environment at the same time. Not so much of that diffused light that you see in the trees, the hardwood trees. I don't know. I just like my pine trees better. Probably because I'm from the east. I'm from the west coast. I think I'm becoming dyslexic. I keep getting my east and west mixed up. I think I'm going to shut off the camera because I got six minutes. That should be enough to fill up today's video.